keep your mind on the good stuff. This is a great time to be alive. But in some ways, I don't think it is a particularly easy time to be alive. We cannot allow the things going on around us, the things bombarding us, to dictate our day. There are times when things seem so tough, thoughts and feelings say you've had enough, then the greater one inside, filled with truth, begins to rise. Walking by faith and not by what I see, running a race, believing what can be, painting a picture of your story, living for God and for His glory. Remember, the people who know their God will be strong and do great exploits. Greater is he who is in you that is in the whole world. It is time to resist worry and anxiety and stand strong. Yes, things are going on around us, but you are a child of God. You are loved and you are capable of doing great things. This is not a time to pull back, but a time to push forward. You are chosen for this hour. There is stuff on the inside of you that the world needs. It's time to fight for the peace of God that passes all understanding. In this prevailing atmosphere, we must fight to live in that peace. We have to be able to live with change. We have to be able to flow and adapt. Our joy and our peace cannot be based on circumstances. We need to rely on God and His truth. It's time to stand strong and to walk by faith and not by sight. It's time to arise and advance. We don't have to give in to the pressure of the difficulties going on around us. You can do all things through Christ who strengthens you. Submit to God, resist the devil, and he will flee from you. Then walk in that victory. So with all that is going on, how do we protect ourselves from being stressed out? Let's take a look at Philippians chapter 4, verse 7. In the Living Bible, it says, If you do this, you will experience God's peace, which is far more wonderful than the human mind can understand. His peace will keep your thoughts and your heart quiet and at rest as you trust in God. Even in chaos, you can still have peace. There are conditions to having that peace. We must refuse to worry about anything. 
Don't worry about what you will eat or drink or wear. Worry doesn't work. An anxious heart weighs a man down. Unload all your worries on God. He loves you and wants to provide for you. Talk to God about everything. Less worry, more asking and thank Him in all things. We are instructed to keep our mind on good things and also to be content in all things. That may not be as easy as it sounds, but it is crucial. We are on the winning side. Stand strong. You have been handpicked for this time. Keep your mind on the good stuff. Let God take care of the other stuff. <laughs>